Hey everyone! Hi! Today we're unboxing the new uh, Danganronpa Special Editions. Yay. We got Monokuma here with us. <laughs> Hopefully he doesn't try to kill us during this episode. <laughs> um, we are going to start with the PS4 version of Danganronpa mm. 1 and 2 Reload. Danganronpa 1 and 2 mm. came out on the Vita a couple years ago. It's an amazing visual novel slash adventure game. Right. Um, if you like, you know, seeing people get killed off one at a time, <laughs> trying to figure out the reason for that. Yeah. If you like, you know, crazy anime courtroom trials. <laughs> um, and, if you like you know, giant bears with murderous intent. Yeah, yeah, the Negan of anime, let's call him. Yeah. <laughs> um, <laughs> Uh, yeah, it's a great series. It's one of my favorite visual novels. I'm, mm -hmm. you know, mostly I like to play my visual novels on handhelds, but for Danganronpa, that's one, because of some of the elements of that, I'm, I'm kind of happy to have it on a console, so. Right, um, yeah. This comes with the first two games, and I forget what's in here, so let's crack it open. This was an exclusive from the Miss America store. Nice. Uh, yeah, so I don't think you could get it in stores. <laughs> First thing I notice is this uh, sticker with Monokuma that says, I'm sorry I was born stupid. <laughs> like a special gift for you. I don't remember that quote from the game, but that is great. I can't imagine him ever saying that unless he was making fun of someone. <laughs> yeah. So next we've got the Danganronpa 1 and 2 soundtrack. Um, this is pretty good. It comes with two discs, one for each of the games. Nice. The music is really good in the games. So mm -hmm. the first disc has was that 16 tracks and the second has 11. So that's a decent yeah. Decent package. Mm -hmm. And then the game, of course. Uh, again, so just your typical mm -hmm. two great murder mystery adventures in one. <laughs> uh, next up is a little hardcover art book. Um, height comparisons at the back. Oh, nice. But yeah, so just little looks at all the characters. Mm -hmm. The quality um, looks really nice compared to some of the little art books we've seen recently. Yeah, it's decent. Uh, there's a gold Monokuma coin. Oh, the Monokuma medals, right? You put these in the slot machine oh. and then you get extra whatever collectibles. Right. That's cool. Which are really only good for earning the trophy except for one that gives you like a special ending in the first game. Don't or say something it. like that. <laughs> I can't remember exactly how that works. Oh my god. And that... For some reason. Those 3D glasses? No. They're just regular old sunglasses. These look to be kind you can find at a dollar store, except that they have Danganronpa on the side. Nice. <laughs> cool. <laughs> not, I'm not so yeah. sure about that. I know who could wear them. Yes. <laughs> they won't fit on him. He's too big. I just uh, wear them bro style on the top. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so Danganronpa 1 and 2 out on mm -hmm. PS4. Please check it out if you like visual novels. Yeah. Even if you don't like visual novels, this is one. This is a good entry point for that genre. Oh yeah, it's a you lot know, of fun. Yeah, it's kind of like 999 or Ace Attorney, not in its content. That's really hard to compare, but in terms of how easy it is to get into and how fun oh, it is and how good it is, yeah, at introducing people to the genre. Mm -hmm. You know, if you're someone who who you know, like me, I couldn't really get into visual novels at first when it was just, here's, let's read 40 hours of text. But right. after playing those series, I really, now I can kind of dive into the, you know, I get mm -hmm. it a bit more. <laughs> um, so in a couple months, I think in June it is, they're releasing the PS4 version of mm -hmm. Danganronpa, another episode, Ultra Despair Girls, which is very different from the other two games. It's a side story. It's an action game. Um, it's not... A visual novel there are still cutscenes and stuff that kind of tell oh. the story it's got characters from the first game and it's supposed to tie the first game to the second game um and it does by showing some what happens to some of the characters after the first game uh mm. but it is very different in terms of gameplay fans don't tend to like it nearly as much as the other two uh the puzzle right. stuff is basically revolves around sh you know shooting different kinds of bullets oh. and that lets you do different things that, you know i don't want to get mm. too much into it but, but I guess in terms of story, it's still worth playing to see yeah, like that sure. in between. That's why I played yeah. through it. Yeah, so I would definitely <laughs> say so. Uh, and, you know, even though it doesn't come out for a couple months, the special edition that they announced is exactly the same as the Vita version. So we decided to go ahead and show you what's in the Vita version because we got mm. that. Uh, and this is it. And so <laughs> first off, um, it comes with this Warriors of Hope. Uh, I don't even know what this thing is. It's like a pin. <laughs> it's a tie clip and a pin. But it's, it's a big massive, yeah. yeah. 
when I first got it, I was like, I had no idea what I was looking at. <laughs> um, <laughs> I don't know how you would use this other than for cosplay, maybe. But even then, like, it seems way too big for that. Use it as I a casual, yeah. everyday tie clip. <laughs> yeah, so. It would weigh you down so much. All right, so now we open up the box oh. with uh, Gangster Monokuma <laughs> on it. very pimp. Yeah. Show the back with... Um, with Momimi. Yeah. <laughs> um, so, the game... You know, it'll be the exact same, but in PS4 case. Um, uh, just like the other one, we get a soundtrack. This one has 15 tracks. Nice. Uh, next up is the art book. Oh, no. Spoilers on the back as to which character is in it. Um, yeah, the whole art book kind of just shows all the characters. The new characters and, you know, the new enemies. Um, some neat stuff in it. <laughs> the new Monokuma variants. The new Monokumas, yeah. <laughs> There's a Monokuma eye patch. <laughs> nice. Which I've never opened before, but now's as good as time as any. I like that it's in the shape of a heart. It's very <laughs> I feel like Majima with this. Yeah, <laughs> nice. <laughs> Again, more cosplay props. Can you see? <laughs> oh, and a tie? And a tie. To use with the tie clip. Whatever reason. Um... I'm not going to embarrass myself by actually trying to tie this. <laughs> For the, the casual everyday cosplayer. Yeah. <laughs> uh, and that's it. So, <laughs> Danganronpa is a series you want to check out. Definitely. Danganronpa 3 is coming out. If you tried to watch the anime, uh, the original Danganronpa anime, and didn't dig it, like, it's real condensed. It doesn't really do a good job of, of describing all the events and the characters and stuff. So, I mean, even though the ending is spoiled for you, I still highly recommend you play the game. There's so much more there. The second game is an incredible follow-up. The story mm -hmm. is just so... It just takes it to some really cool places. <laughs> and I feel like these three games are the end of this arc of Danganronpa. Mm -hmm. So there were two other anime series that came out. I think they're available on Funimation.com or something like that. Where uh, one takes place in between the two games... And one takes place, I think, before the whole series. I, mm. I don't, or maybe after. I'm not sure. I need to watch them still. Uh, but I think that they've kind of said those series were made to finish off Danganronpa oh, now. Okay. So the new Danganronpa three, which is coming out this year, is supposed to be something. I don't know if it's totally new. It can't. It can't be because they need to have a reason right, to want to yeah. come in there. But uh, it'll be like a fresh start for a lot of people. So nice. Um, awesome. Thanks for checking out this episode. We'll see you next time. See you. Bye. <laughs> <laughs>